welcome to my channel. If today is your first time of coming across my channel, don't forget to subscribe. Hit the notification bell each time I post a video, you'll be notified. So we'll be making Ankara flower facilitator. Hi guys, today we'll be making Ankara flower shape. So what we'll be needing in making this, we need Ankara fabric, we need UAC gun, we need a thread and needle. We need a cover button. So we don't need much actually. So guys, before we go into the video, don't forget to like the video, subscribe, and hit the notification bell. So each time I post a video, YouTube will be notified. So let's move into the making of Okay guys, the first thing first, we have a little Ankara material, which I cut, um, which I cut six by seven inches. So what I will do now is, I'll use the UAC gun on the edge. Then I'll fold. Then I'll do the same thing the other side. And after folding it, um, we got something like this. We got something like this. So, lady, uh, ready? I have uh, like five pieces of it here. So we start our stitching and joining them together. Then I'll fold it like this. Then I'll start running the stitches. Then I'll pick another one of food.
don't forget that after sewing, I have an extra uh, uh, thread at the end here because of the dragon. Then after joining the last one, which is the fifth one, then I'll drag them together. So after stitching, I'll cut the tray. We'll be adding a cover button to it. is for us to add the cover button.
then we leave it for a little time to dry. So guys, after look at what we got here, you can use it as a facilitator. You can do a smaller it and use it to design airbound bags or just create it for a fans to design either bag, Ankara bag, or whatever Ankara something you're designing. I feel like you need something like flower to design it. You can do a little of it and use it. To it and we can use this one you can also use it as a facilitator and we can also add it in our hair bag or carabag or whichever uh, 